Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube, or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Also, shout out Bread from YouTube for commissioning this video. I got some new stuff in store. Why don't you come inside? Oh, look who it is. One of my favorites. Welcome back. It seems that you actually slithered your way around the phenomenon that is that creature. You're getting a lot better at this, which I am quite surprised at. I thought you would die at one of the first floors, but you're something different. Mm-hmm. Also, I picked up another key card that you could use. It's right there on that table. Go ahead and pick it up for me. All right. I have some new things in stock. After looting some dead bodies, I found... But if you give me some information that you have gathered, I'll gladly trade an item for it. Mm, I don't need information about that. I need something new. Do you have anything of new information for me? If not, then you're going to have to use your money to buy some items off of me. You have one thing. Well, let's not be stingy now. Hand it over. All right, let's see. Mm -hmm. Interesting, interesting. I think I can do something with this information. Let's see, what else is there? Oh, really? I didn't know that could actually happen to those creatures. Well, I'll be making sure to keep this in one of my important areas. But a deal is a deal. You get to have an item of your choice off my tail. Go on, take your pick. Ah, yes, the med kit as well is very good around here. And I did kind of notice that your arm is injured, so... <laughs> yes, well, that creature is something of exponential speed. It's hard to run away from it, so I understand. Mm-hmm. I also have noticed a few more extendables. Yes, they have been running around on the first floors. Luckily, well, not luckily for them, but luckily for me, I found their corpses near a wall-dweller chunk. And, well, let's just say they didn't make it. In one piece. But I did find all these items off of their body. There seemed to be quite the looters up there. And I also nabbed their name tags as well. Would you like me to read them off? 
I know it may not interest you, but I always seem to find it funny how these names could be so stupid and idiotic. All right, let's see. The first name tag I found, which is half Aiton, says the name was Bunny, which is interesting because um, bunnies are usually fast and, well, looks like they weren't fast enough. The next name tag, which was covered in blood, I think they were maybe the last one to survive until one of the other Wall Dweller Chunks nabbed him. His name was Dom. Interesting name. And this name gave me a laugh because who names themselves like this? Their name was Sol Umfgai. Can you imagine that? Naming yourself that would... It's just ridiculous. But I didn't actually quite get your name. Because, well, I usually call all the humans that run down here extendables. So, could I get your name? Since you're more, less stupid than these ones were. Mm-hmm. I see, I see. Well, it's nice to meet you. Properly this time. This reminds me of other extendables that I've seen in my past who have run by. Mm-hmm. There was this one time there was a group of extendables, around three or four. And when they reached my store, or my little hideout here, they usually would pick up the key cards and whatnot that I leave on the table for the extendables to grab. But these extendables were extremely stupid, and they decided to buy flashlights and shine them in my eyes. Even though I told them multiple times to not do that, and I would break their flashlight every time they do it. To teach them a lesson. But sadly, I had more flashlights on my tail for sale, so they kept buying more. In short, the last few that were flashing their lights into my eyes met their fate at the end of my triple barrel shotgun. I swear, it's these extendables can be so idiot, so idiotic that it makes me malfunction in a way. It makes my brain rot in its core. To think how stupid humans can actually be, and yet I used to be one of those. But at least I have a little bit more brains than these little extendables. Unlike you, of course, because, well, you're down here, and you survived all these hallways and uh, creatures of just nightmare fuel. Me? Oh, I can survive down here pretty easily. Most of these creatures are no fight against me. I am... Well, let's say powerful. Yes, I can hold myself up for a while now. I can take care of all these creatures by myself, so anytime I have to leave these little quarters, I have to slither through the vents and whatnot. And to get to one of these more open rooms, I have to go through the halls. And when I do, when I run into one of these creatures, I can take care of them with ease. Not like these extendables, though. 
These extendables have to use all sorts of tactics and whatnot. Me, I can just, well, use brute force. And my above intellect as well. <laughs> yes, it is quite funny to see them try and survive down here. It keeps me entertained, at least. But I shouldn't be keeping you here. You have other floors to explore and try to escape, correct? All right. I hope to see you again.